All right, 2012 Mercedes-Benz ML63 AMG. And I've got a little bit of road or curb rash, sorry, curb rash on this rim here. Hit the rim a bit hard on the curb. So I'm going to sand this and use some aluminum bond and paint it. Let's see how it works out. You can see that's yeah, pretty, it's, it's not super bad, but there are some deep scratches there. Okay, so I just got my block here. I'm going to sand this. I think this is about 220 grit or 240 grit, something like that. And I'll update you on the progress. All right, I've been sanding for just a couple minutes here. It's starting to flatten out a bit there. You can see the actual aluminum under the paint there. I still got some deep marks to work on. Okay, I've pretty much knocked down all the high spots. So what I'm gonna do now is just clean here. Just kind of wipe everything down, get all the dust out. You can see I've taken the paint off there. Um, down here a bit too. That's all right, I've got paint. Next step though, is going to be the aluminum bond filler that I have to fill these gaps. Okay, so this is the stuff that I bought. Um, it's aluminum repair, specifically for aluminum. And I'm going to use this to fill in the, kind of the gaps that are left from the curb rash there. And then I'm gonna let that dry and we'll sand it. So you just mix this at a one-to-one -one ratio. So that's about a one-to-one -one ratio, close enough. And then I'm just gonna take my putty knife and mix that all up. Now it says to mix for about three minutes. I don't need a ton of it, but I'm just gonna continue to knead it back and forth a little bit here. Okay, so here is the stuff, and I'm gonna just kinda spread that in here to these Okay, so I've spread the Aluma Bond on there. Now, this has to cure for four to five hours, and then I will sand and hopefully have a nice smooth, smooth finish there. All right, I removed the wheel uh, so I can avoid any overspray when I finally spray the wheel paint on. So this is what it looks like with it cured on there. So I just need to sand that, get that smooth, and then we can paint. All right, I'm gonna to try to get in close here. I went from about 120 to 2000, or 1000 grit sandpaper. And I'm just gonna clean this up now with some cleaner and then we'll spray after that. Okay, so everything I've read online says that for Mercedes-Benz, this Worth silver wheel paint is the best stuff you can get. It wasn't very expensive. I've got this all prepped here. I'm just gonna spray some of this wheel paint on in really light coat. All right, I'm not sure how well you'll be able to see this in the sun, but there it is with the first coat of paint on it. Looks pretty close. I'd say it's nearly an identical match. And there is no sign of that curb rash anywhere. I'm going to spray some clear on it now and then I'm gonna mount it back on the vehicle and show you what the final product looks like. Okay, I just wanted to show you what it looks like. The final product here. This is where the road rash was right in here. I think it turned out pretty good. I'm gonna go, I cleared it and obviously took off the masking material. I'm gonna go put it on the vehicle now and show you what it looks like. Okay, so here's the final product. Got the wheel back on the car. 
So this is the area here where there was the rash. Right where the valve stem is, that area. Turn a different angle on it, but I think it turned out virtually flawless. And that paint is an absolute perfect match. So there it is.